Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Fan Film Friday. I have a really cool, uh, different fan film uh, horror edition for you. This came out in 2021. It's 33 minutes, and it is a short horror film based on the Silent Hill um, game and movie franchise called Silent Hill Restless Dreams. And um, I was drawn to this by one of the lead actors, and I'll get to that in a second. It was directed by Colton Dietz and Christian Life Jones, written by Colton Dietz, starring Vic Mignagna, Mignagna. And um, I've actually met him. Uh, he plays James Sunderland. And uh, Vic, Vic and I go way back. Uh, we He is a very regular um, celebrity at any convention that happens here in my city. Uh, he is like a huge fan favorite. He is uh, very well known as a voice actor for a lot of different animes, and he's done um, some really cool live action stuff, particularly a classic Star Trek um, kind of like continuation where he plays uh, Kirk, and that would be the William Shatner version of Kirk. And um, he just really embodies that younger. William Shatner, James Kirk, and uh, I loved those. I, I was able to attend like a private screening of like one of the first um, episodes of that. So anyways, I digress, but Vic is in this, and if you're a fan of Vic, and I know I'm butchering his last his last name, but it's Mignaga, Mignaga. I'm horrible with names. Uh, Mercedes Peterson plays Maria, and there is San Diego... Craig plays Dr. Kaufman. There's a lot of other characters in this. Um, the story is a troubled man makes his way through the monster infested town of Silent Hill as he searches for his deceased wife and tries to come to terms of what happened in his past. So um, it, this has like some mixed reactions. There's people that are hating on it a few um i did because of it being vic um i i did kind of lo look it up and um overwhelmingly it says if you're a silent hill fan um you will enjoy this now i'm um a casual fan of the silent hill franchise i've never played the game i've seen a little bit of gameplay on youtube um, watch the first movie, but I'm not like super into, um, it. So I'm not a hundred percent like positive on the lore and things like that. But, but even without that for this 33 minutes, I was easy. It was easy for me to follow along. And the film style itself is, I, I think it was playing on the restless dreams title as it doesn't seem to be like, continually flowing like one um james the character james you know searching for his deceased wife through the silent hill um he he is interrupted and oh and wakes up and then there's a whole nother sequence and then wakes up and it's a whole nother so it's like restless dreams it's literally like that that was my take on it and i thought that was kind of interesting and there are different characters um, I know a huge fan favorite favorite of all the Silent Hill is that, and I'm probably not even going to call it the right thing, but it's that metallic triangle head dude, that big shirtless beefcake. Um, he's in this. And uh, I thought, oh, that's cool. And uh, once you get to that part, you know, you really, really feel the Silent Hill vibe. Like you're already going to get it um, from just the, the, the story unfolding and Vic's performance. Um, and then just the way, you know, if you know the lore, um, but it was really like watching in my opinion, because I'm not really knowledgeable. It was kind of like, my take was that it was coming in and out of dreams, but it also kind of translated into that's probably how the game plays, uh, where it would be like each sequence you're getting through to the next, the next to the next and then the ending really kind of shocked me i was like not really sure what to expect for the ending and then when the ending came i was like oh okay this is a little crazy 
little crazy, but I'd really be interested in hearing some feedback from actual Silent Hill aficionados um, out there. So if you are someone in the know, you can fill in the gaps for me down below in the, in the comments. Um, I think I forgot to mention what the channel name was that this um, is on. It's Super Kitty, S-U-P-E-R-K-E-D-E. -E -E, and um, they are linked down below. And they have also other social medias as well, like Twitter and all that stuff, as they should, because, you know, when you do fan films and things, you want to promote that out. So the fan film, Restless Dreams, will be linked below and the channel itself so check them out especially if you're a silent hill fan i think uh you're overwhelmingly gonna get something out of this it's 33 minutes it's not like a horrible uh four hour film that you have to sit through um but i'd be interested to hear some some thoughts from some actual like real diehard silent hill fans um and keep in mind these are fan films so don't go super critical on on stuff and and leave hate in my uh, comment section, because uh, that's not what these fan film reviews are about. These are about uh, giving some attention to people that are doing independent work uh, on the level of, you know, independent. They're just trying to do their best with what resources they have. This one obviously has some more resources because they uh, they hired have actual actors in it and things like that. Anyways, that's going to do it for today. Check out this film silent hill and leave comments and all that good stuff row 18 plot 20 <laughs>